If you've ever had a bad knee, you know it hurts. It hurts when you walk, it hurts when you climb stairs, it even hurts when you get in and out of chairs. Sometimes getting relief from that pain means getting knee replacement surgery. But who has time to be laid up from such a major surgery? Well, cutting edge technology used by the surgeons at Peninsula Orthopedic Associates in Salisbury can shorten that time. It did for one woman. Faye Hatton of Salisbury is recovering from knee replacement surgery. I was just having some knee pain and it felt like it would pop out a joint. And believe it or not, she's only two weeks into that recovery. Yeah, I gave up the walker um, Wednesday after the surgery on Monday. She is walking without a walker. She is walking without a cane. Dr. Scott Gelman performed the surgery at Peninsula Orthopedic Associates Surgery Center in Salisbury. Nowadays, we're doing a lot of our surgeries at our surgery center where we are today. And in many cases, including Faye's, Dr. Gelman got some help from this. This is the Mako Smart Robotics for Total Knee Replacement. What the robot does is that it gives us more consistency and it gives us more information. Dr. Gelman says the Mako helps surgeons better tailor knee replacement surgery to patients. And we've done that in various steps. And this is just the new step in that progression where now a computer is more involved in telling us where to place the knee replacement what size to place it in and how much tension to put the ligaments on when we do that. That tension is crucial. Without the Mako, surgeons determine tension in the ligaments by feel. In addition to providing consistency during knee replacement surgery, the robot supplies surgeons with important data. We are still the ones doing the surgery though. The robot is telling us where to place the knee replacement, what size, um, and how to place it. And as high-tech and futuristic as this robot may seem to some, robotic surgery is nothing new. A lot of us have had experience with the robot before we have it here at our surgery center. My training program got uh, a robotic knee replacement system in my last two years of training, just when I was starting to do a lot of the surgeries and being very involved in the surgeries. And when I learned in training, I learned how to do the robotic knee replacements. In fact, Dr. Gelman says robotic surgery is the future. This is gonna be a progression in the future. These are gonna make us better and better surgeons and give more and more predictable results for our patients. Positive results for patients like Faye are the reason Dr. Gelman does what he does. Seeing patients limp into my office, having extraordinary, extraordinary pain, uh, at home, having a hard time doing things around their house. And then two weeks later, she's already feeling almost better than she did before. Um, I usually I tell patients that's going to take four to six weeks, and she's certainly ahead of that curve. But to see patients walking well, having less pain, um, I do think that's an exceptional part of what we do, and it's the best part of what we do for sure. And thanks to a partnership with Tidal Health, patients are kept out of the hospital. Part of that partnership having the robotic knee replacement gives us a little bit more trust and predictability in getting patients home and it expands the number of patients we can keep out of the hospital during these times out of the hospital yeah i feel uh comfortable thinking that i'm going to be able to do pretty much the same thing that i've did before and back into life dr gelman adds the mako smart robotics allows him to cut less which can mean less soft tissue damage and greater bone preservation.